Bonjour. I would like to create a large bowl. So first of all, I want, I don't have a very big mold, so I'm going to create a barrier. I'll pour in that barrier and then later on in the day, I can take it out and shape it in the shape that I would like. So I want to show you these two products that have come from Just For You Online UK. They are in two parts and it is silicon mold making putty. Silicon mold making putty and they come in two parts. And all you need to do is mix equal amounts of A and B. Mix until the color is homogenized, so blended basically. And then make your shape, make your barrier on your silicon mat, which comes from Just For You Online UK, the mats. And you can either eyeball it, or if you're not good at that, then simply weigh it. So I will sh show you how I do it. So I have equal parts of A and B. Make sure you close the containers properly. Seal them tight, otherwise the putty will dry. And now all I need to do is switch off my scales, which are covered in resin. And we are going to mix these two products together until they are thoroughly blended in color. So this will take about a minute or so, depending on the amount that you've got. And I want to mix it until I no longer see any white streaks in my putty. You can use silicon to make barriers, but I find that a really messy procedure. And more importantly for me, because I suffer from migraines, the smell of silicon just is horrendous. Okay, so my putty is now the right color. It's all nicely mixed. I don't need this to be high because it's going to be just a relatively thin layer of resin and you just arrange it the way you want to. Make sure there is some form of barrier otherwise it will go straight across and you can shape it.
and then I can clean the inside with some isopropanol alcohol. Once this is dry, which will take about anything from 5 to 15, 20 minutes, depending on how thick your mixture, your yes, your barrier is, I can pour resin inside. And now all I need to do is um, clean this section with a little bit of alcohol. Sorry, I hadn't realized it was so out of center to the video. So my center is as clean as I can make it. I'm gonna let this dry and mix some resin. Okay, this is dry, c'est sec. Et maintenant, je peux commencer à mettre ma résine. C'est l'automne qui arrive. Donc, j'ai pensé que ce serait sympa de faire des couleurs automnales. Autumn is coming, so I thought it would be nice to use some aut autumn color colors. Sorry. Floating, precious gold floating pigment powder. Caramel gold. Lava gold. Pearl Flame, Rich Brown, Premium Ivory, and Burnt Orange. All these colors come from Just For You Online UK, as did the paste, as did the silicon mat, as did all the stirring sticks. Use the code Valerie to save, all in capital letters, to save 20% on your purchases of four products or more with them. So the rest of the video I'll do silently. I hope you enjoy it. I will show you the rest when it has cured sufficiently for me to take it off and shape. I hope you enjoy it.
Hello, this is partially cured. It is still malleable enough that I can shape it. And it's the first time that I've done such a big piece. So my largest bowl is this one. I'm going to see if this works. If it doesn't, I'll figure something else out. So it's just a question of pulling off, first of all, this putty that is now totally hard. And in the past, I have reused them. The only thing I find is that the connection with the mat isn't always great. So you can reuse it and put a little bit of glue gun um, behind it so that the resin doesn't escape. As you can see, the edges are totally clean. No resin came underneath. And these two pieces of gold were me just drizzling over the top. So just remove it gently. We want to take our time. It's a big piece to work with. So let's have a look. I kind of want to center it. And then gently press it down. Donc, je veux le centrer, la centrer et tout doucement, whoops, la presser et essayer de lui donner une forme qui me plaît. Là, elle est plus haute. So if you find it's higher in one place than another, take it out and gently redo it. The colors are glorious, absolutely glorious. And I just place these bottles are so handy. Not only do I love the product and the, all the colors, but they're great to do this with. And you just place them wherever you fancy. However you want your bowl to look like, your cup, your... Sorry, I'm having difficulty speaking. Holidays are not doing me any good. And just manipulate it a little bit. Take your time. It's art. It's not machine made. And each one that we make is different. And that's the beauty of it. And there we are. Let's bring it. Whoops. One fell. Put it back in. There we go. And I'm absolutely in love with these colors. They turned out even better than I was hoping. J'adore ce mélange de couleurs. So because this is a much larger piece than normal, today it's going to dry now and cure fully in this, um, in this bowl. And I am going to leave it in there for three or four days because it's so big, I don't want to take it out and then find that it flops down. So it needs to just stay like this for three, four days, however long it takes. Just play around with it if there's a few things you're not happy with. Like I say, this is very much handmade. It's artistic. Well, I hope. <laughs> I hope you're not all vomiting. Um, I try to show you nice things, but occasionally. Not, art isn't to everybody's taste. 
we're all different. I may love something that you may hate, but hopefully you will enjoy this. Je vous embrasse et à bientôt. Love to all of you. See you soon. Bye.